Hello everyone, it's I, Sakamoto, and I'm here with more The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening DX for the Game Boy Color. I think I already got this secret seashell, I just want to check real quick. Yep, okay. So we got a bunch of sad questing to do for this episode, and we're going to jump right into it real quick. Uh, yeah. First thing, we need to go approach Orira's house here, uh, right side window, and the photographer shows up and goes, Hi, it's me, the photographer. You seem curious about Grandpa Orira. I'll call this, Kion discovers Orira's secret. Excuse me. He's just on the phone. Yahoo! I'm fine, and you? And other stuff we gotta do. We need to go to the tail cave. I thought there was one more thing I needed to do in the town. I don't know. That's it. At least I hope that's it. Yeah, we gotta go get a secret seashell. A third one. Wrong way. There it is. Break out your bombs. Put them against the wall. That's practice. Eh? Go through the wall. Get the chest, find a secret seashell, collect a lot of these, some good found habit. Alright. And now we can leave, because that's all we need from here. Okay. <laughs> Why not? That was dust. Jumping spin attack. Yeehaw! It's a new attack I recently figured out, but maybe I did it. I'm pretty sure I've done that before. <laughs> it's just been so long since I played Game Boy Zelda that I forgot about it. I believe we do need to go this way now. More secret seashells and some other things. Oh god. So, we need to lift up that rock with the power bracelet. Grab this, get another secret seashell. Every time I get a guardian acorn or a piece of power, I feel like the kid from that meme, or vine, it's like, that gets an avocado for his birthday or Christmas or whatever, it's just like, wow, an avocado, thanks. He's just clearly very not so excited about it. He's like, gee, wow, thanks. We're about to get a piece of heart in a second here. Now that we've got the power bracelet, we can also lift these things up. You got a piece of heart. Press select on the subscreen to see. You collected four pieces of heart. Now you have a complete heart container. Woohoo! We now have six heart containers. Alright. Celebration! We gonna celebrate and have a good time. <laughs> Thank you. 
Ah! Hey! Okay, now lift up this rock. Go down the stairwell. Hidden stairwell here. Come over to this hole. Grab yourself your magic powder. Throw it down the, throw one down the hole. And this little thing comes out and it's a bat dude and he's like, Hey kid, you woke me up from a fine nap. Thanks a lot. But now I'll get my revenge. Are you ready? Doesn't matter what you say here. See, look. N no. I'll let you carry more magic powder. Hey, <laughs> hey, are you ready? Now, if you have more than just magic powder, if you also have either the bombs and or the arrows, if you say no, he'll then let you carry more bombs or arrows. So we're going to say no, because I want more bombs. Okay, I'll let you carry more bombs. Hee <laughs> hee, are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> you deserve it. Oh, look at all that junk you have to carry. Ha! Take care. See you again. Okay. Have a great... Alright, now we're back out here. Yeah, we need to go... Uh, get a fifth secret seashell. Yeah, let's see. Let me check sometime. Wow, an avocado! Thanks! So let me show you what's in here real quick, actually. Oh, those zombie monsters are gonna respawn, but whatever. Nothing right now, because we need the hook shot to get through there. I believe we will get it in the lab. here, and drop this rock, and there's another secret seashell right there. Ooh, after we get it, dig it. Dig it out. There it is. Okay, now we gotta go down here, because we can get a piece of heart. Also, come over this way. as many cracks. There must be some way to shatter it. Da, da, da. Oh crap. No, now we gotta go back. Fiddlesticks. Jellyfish things. Oh, I only have three hearts. Dang it. I may have to go visit Crazy Tracy again. Oh man. Okay. There we go. Aha! I think the game wants you to crack that open. Don't push this to the right. That, that one you just push off, obviously, and then, like, use the Pegasus boots and the Rock's Feather to, like, jump over there. But we got it anyway, so we're not having to do all that, which is great. Obviously. Bye! So Kami Chris says bye, and she's like, bye! Call me Chris the best, by the way. I got into her because of Smosh. Um, trying not to laugh, she was on as a guest. And I was like, oh, maybe her content's cool. And then I checked out her shorts and stuff. And she's this great actress that does all these char original characters on her own. And then even her like regular YouTube content, where she mostly reacts to things, is actually really good, too. I usually hate reaction content creators, but she does other stuff, too. She like visits spooky places and weird products. This is Richard. Salutations. You wouldn't know by the look of me, but I used to live in the castle. My servants went berserk, and I was forced to flee my villa. So, you want the key to a cuckoo prairie, do you? 
I may be able to help you. Let's make a deal, shall we? I want you to retrieve the golden leaf I left behind in the castle when I fled. Okay. I am impressed. There are f five! You said one! Leaves and all. <laughs> Remember to buy a shovel on your way back. Yeah, I already got the shovel, but thanks. Let me just check real quick. Make sure we got everything we needed so far. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, alright, we're good. Secret Seashell Mansion. Because when you have exactly 5, 10, and 15 Secret Seashells, you can go to the mansion and get... Well, I know from the fifth one you get a, uh, another Secret Seashell. You know what, let's do this real quick. There's another photography opportunity here. Hi, Kion. You know I love to take pictures. Wouldn't this old castle make a great photo? Nothing yet? I grow tired of waiting. I want those golden leaves delivered soon! Birds like this deserves a photo, don't you think? Go ahead and take a picture of me. Any angle you like. You have a sword too? I'm not afraid. I just decided to wait at home. Yeah. Whatever, man with a sword also, who could have also got came and gotten the frickin' leaves and done this himself. You know, frickin' baloney head. Mr. Lazy Guy over here. Mr. I'm not afraid. Yeah, okay. So we come to the right, and that's all this is, really. Um, just this little room. That meter goes up to the right past those uh, circles, and you got a secret seashell. There's also a really easy one to get right next to the mansion. We're gonna grab that real quick. And when we have 10, we'll visit the uh, mansion again. And I believe we can get like 12 uh, all right here. Yeah, this is a super easy one I was talking about. And then we just come down here, and the castle is actually right up here. Uh, I mean, we just came from there, but... Bananas! Bananas! Ooh! Ooh! Give the Kiki? Yes. Bananas! Bananas! Ooh! Ooh! Kiki! Monkeys! Come! Repay him, Kiki! So as you can see... We're done with the bananas. Uh, finally, we're trading them off for something else. Monkey business done. Bye bye. Ooh, Kiki. And what we're getting is a stick. We found a stick. A monkey left behind. You take it. Yeah. And now we're basically in the castle, or we're on the grounds, or whatever you want to call it. And we're here basically. Kind of have a bush to chop up, like in Link to the Past, to get into the castle. Okie dokie, here the chokey. <laughs> and we're in. Alright, this is our first guy to deal with. He's a little bit tricky to fight. He comes out of these holes randomly and throws bombs if you wait too long to hit him. Crap. He makes me nervous. Why I find him tricky. Come on, there we go. You found the gold leaf. Press start to see how many you've collected. So there's three inside the castle, two on the outside. We're gonna go grab the other one on the outside real quick. Uh. Let's no, screw you guys. I'm going this way. Nope. Too freaking annoying to deal with. 
Okay, grab this stone, throw it at the raven. The raven will give you your second golden leaf. You found a gold leaf. Press start to see how many you collected. Woohoo! Yeah, heart I don't need. Alright. And now we're here. Oh, that spooky music. Oh, jeez. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I don't remember if I... I think I explained about them. In the last episode, or the first one. I don't remember. Hey, there's a gold leaf. I almost went up without getting it. That's three down, two to go. Just open the gates up. Oh yeah, I forgot the piece of power makes you go faster. I keep I think I mentioned that before too. <laughs> oh well. Alright, so there's these two guys. I just probably should have waited on that one. One of them has a golden leaf, the other one doesn't. If you let them stab you, you can just be invincible for a second and get them. I guess. That's a, strat that's a strategy. <laughs> I don't know if it's good or bad, but whatever. About to get the last golden leaf. In order to get through that room, lift up one of these pots and throw it at the doll. There's a heart there if you need it. I don't know if there's any others. And if there is and I need them, I'm just gonna find out when I come back. These guys can be tricky, but if you just come up to them and whack your sword out of a crap load, just, that's it. At last, you got the final golden leaf. Now go and see Richard about that key. So, is there another heart here? Oh, bombs. Whatever. Uh, we need to go back this way. Hey, look at that. Ouchies. Alright, that's done. Okay, now let's see what else we can do. Uh... Oh no, I messed up. I forgot about these guys. They, you see their eyes first and they extend these giant necks out from these holes and then they... I guess their pinchers kind of sort of pseudo get you. Before we go to Retro, I believe there is another secret seashell nearby. Right over here. Nope. Not there. Come on now. I think there's somewhere we can use the stick over there though. Whatever. Let's just go get this frickin' key, and I think another secret key shell as well. Ah, Trabian! I see you have recovered all of the leaves! I move this box and you will find your reward! Great! Wow, an avocado! Thanks! <laughs> Why do you have monsters out down here, buddy? Oh wait, 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 what's in that treasure chest? Please be rupees? Oh, it's a secret seashell. Interesting. Alright, so two more and we gotta go back to the mansion for what will probably be our 11th. Yeehaw! 
Alright, this is annoying, but not too bad to deal with. Yeah, um, certain bushes obviously will have holes. And that's not great or fun, but... Wait a minute. Let me try something. Interesting, interesting. Aha, uh -huh, I see. <laughs> what the heck? I wound up having to go back here anyway. Richard thinks he's cute with his frickin' maze on here. Well, it's not cute, Richard. In fact, it's quite annoying. But I'll deal with it. Because I must. For the honor and the glory of the quest. Uh, flash the blade by Iron Maiden minutes. <laughs> or something. Um... Yeah, there we go. Okay. Here we go. We need to... In soil, sleep secrets beneath your souls. Basically, it's not easy. That's why, also, Richard told you to get a shovel. You've got the sign key. Now you can open the gate in your cuckoo prairie. Boy, I wish I didn't have to go through this again. Now I have to walk all the way back. Uh... And deal with the bushes some more. If I had the, um, this one song you learn that takes you right outside Tracy, that Tracy, yeah, Crazy Tracy's house, um, I believe it's the Mambo's Pond, uh, I would be playing it right now. Yeah, you get this ocarina at some point. Pretty soon, actually, I think after the third dungeon. Anyway. might be where the other secret seashell I was thinking might be. Can you... Did you see that, uh, diamond shape with the bushes there? Yep. Okay. Cool.
Let's go this way. up this rock and we get another secret seashell. Woohoo! Uh back to the shrine. Yes, because we have ten now. Found a secret t-shirt. Collect a lot of these. Something good is bound to happen. Wahoo! Alright, the next one. Okay. Watch out for uh, these skulls. They'll do that. They have little crabs inside them. That might be a. Oh, hello. Feel the difference? Interesting. Secret Seashell. Yeah, it was diagonally down and left from him. Whatever. Close enough. Ouchies! Come on now, y'all. Alright, great, 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 great. I should probably use my shield more. Now what? Ugh. Oh great. Okay, 
I just didn't want to deal with these guys again. Oh man, how are you able to hit me from there? A lot of those spider things don't come out when you're digging in this game. One thing that does suck about Link's Awakening, at least this version and the original version, is most of the rupees you get from anywhere but chests. You only get pretty, actually pretty much all of them, except for the ones you find in chests. Uh, you only get one at a time. Um, the seasons and agents, agents, when you agents, <laughs> ages games. Uh, when you dig. You'll sometimes get up to 100 rupees. Uh, they can range from anywhere from 5 to 10 to 20, I believe. 50 to 100. Um, okay. Wonder what is over there. Cool. Yeah, okay. The next thing, all we have to do now is go to the dungeon. Cause I already got that one that they're talking about. Oh, those are the spiders I was thinking of. Uh, I don't know why I didn't really get to that. Um, <laughs> but if you're dealing, in seasons and ages when you're digging around, sometimes you'll dig up those spiders. Hope you guys have a great